Today we're going to install the Mad Jack's 84 inch four passenger top designed for the club car precedent. Included in the kit are new struts, rear brackets, front brackets, and stiffener brackets. You also have a hardware pack that's decrement coated. The top is sold separately and is universal across all major models. It comes in black, tan, and white. Now let's get started. To begin our installation, remove your old canopy and your old rear struts. First thing we're going to do is remove the front bolt and the main bracket and add our stiffener bracket in. Now we're going to attach our stiffener bracket with the slotted hole on the top of the main bracket and attach using our 8 by 50 millimeter hardware and a 14 millimeter socket. Now using the top hole in our stiffener, we're going to use a 5 16 drill bit and safety goggles and drill through the main bracket. Now using our 8 by 35 millimeter hardware, we're going to attach the top of the stiffener to the main bracket. Using a 14 millimeter socket, tighten the hardware and repeat on the other side. Now we're going to attach our front brackets to our front struts. One thing you want to notice on the front bracket is the vertical slotted hole. That needs to go to the back of the cart. We're also going to attach the bracket on the outside of the strut using the 6 by 40 millimeter hex head bolts. We're going to tighten up the front bolt, but leave the back loose. We're going to leave the rear bolt loose so that when we attach our canopy, we can adjust our height and then tighten. Now we're going to repeat this process on the passenger side. Now we're going to insert our rear struts into our main supports, but we're not going to tighten yet. We're going to do that later. Then we're going to take our rear brackets and attach it to the bottom of the struts. Make sure your strut is pointing to the rear of the cart. Now we're going to attach the rear bracket to the bottom of the strut using the small holes. The large holes, we're going to go to the outside of the cart. You're going to use the six millimeter carriage bolts and insert them through the top of the rear strut. Now attach using the flat washer, lock washer, and then nut and tighten. Now we're going to repeat this process on the passenger side. Now that we have all of our brackets attached, we're going to place our top on our struts. Make sure the curved edge of the top goes to the front of the cart. Now we're going to take the 8 by 25 millimeter carriage bolts and insert them into the corner down into the channel of the extrusion and into our brackets. Now we're going to attach our hardware but hand tighten for now. Now you can install your carriage bolts on your other three brackets, but do not tighten. Now that we have our brackets attached, before you tighten your hardware, you want to slide the top into your desired location. I generally like to have the back of the top, even with the outside of the cup holder. Once you have your desired location, tighten your hardware. Now we're ready to attach our struts, but before we do, we have two options. You can use the pre-drilled hole locations, or if you want your top lower in the rear, you just slide it down and drill new holes. We're going to use the retain hardware from our old struts and tighten. Now we're going to repeat this process on the passenger side. Now that we have our rear struts attached, we're going to move back up to the front brackets and tighten up the rear bolts. Once that's done, we're now finished installing our Mad Jacks four passenger 84 inch top designed for the club car precedent.